Hello everyone. This is Judy coming to you from my sweat loft. And uh, I have finished the box completely. It's finished. And I've got one of the scrapbooks done for my great grandson. Uh, the baby showers tomorrow. And I have another book almost finished. And uh, I'm going to show it to you because the showers tomorrow. And uh, I don't know if she'll let me bring it back home and finish it or not. But this is the box finished. And uh, on my last video, I had asked for help to um, finish it out because it just didn't look finished. And I didn't like the cars that I had on there, the vehicles. And uh, Nilda Vanilla said to put a ribbon across the opposite side of the D. And that's what I did. And then I put some some gears on there, and I love it. I love it. And I got my legs in, so it's got legs on it now. It's got the feet on it. So there's the box finished. Um, I don't know if you want to see the inside of it again or not, but we'll do a quick. Some of you may not have seen it. I don't know. <clears throat> and that's how it opens. Opens like this, and to keep this lid here from flopping like that when you let it down, I put a magnet on each side with these chipboard clocks to hold it down. And that's for storage. And I know it's a masculine box for a baby, but my granddaughter wanted more masculine for him and I had a hard time I, I couldn't find anything in, in what she wanted uh, so I just did the box masculine so that he could use this throughout his life and not be you know when they get to be teenagers or something they don't want anything that looks babyish so I made it masculine so he could use it as he gets older and then here's the <clears throat> next second book that I made and um, these little characters were a gift from uh, Ebony at Sharing More and I just love them they went with this paper pad this paper pad is um, oh where's it at what have I done with that paper pad I got like four or five projects going at one time. Paper Studios Petite BB, Bebe, whatever. <laughs> and this is an EK Success Punch. And these clouds are um, chipboard clouds that was gifted to me from Alicia Wagman in a rack that she sent. And I made the book to open like this it's like a box book and um everything i just left everything plain on the ends she doesn't want anything real frilly so i didn't do it and on the back i just uh, did a um cut out with made with love especially for declan by great grandma and my full name and then i signed great grandma on it so let's just get into it like I said it is not finished um, I still like some embellishing and some tags this has a swing tab and it just opens like this and this is a Tim Holtz uh, spinner and this is a um, heart that says love. And I got that, I think, through Amazon. Now this is a uh, one of those characters from Ebony. And this is going to be, this is a pocket. It's magnetic closure. This flips down and that flips up.
this flips over and this flips over this is an accordion fold I did put a ribbon in here <laughs> but a couple and it has a place for eight pictures And then I have a belly band here to put a booklet. And I left this so you could get a hold of it. My bows are always upside down. I tie upside down. Another character from Ebony, and this is just a waterfall. Like I said, I still have to come back and do some finishing touches. I need to do some things with this. Over here, I made a deep pocket. I, d I have started, I've got my tags cut for this in my booklet. Just don't have them don't have the paper on them yet or the um, I'm just not finished I don't even have the tags in the ends of them yet and here's a waterfall another one of them little characters from Ebony ah, here's the other ribbon like that and then this opens another character from Ebony this is glittered here because this Sizzix die it wouldn't for some reason it wouldn't cut that out and I sent it through four times but it wouldn't cut that out like I said, I did it, no, I, I made four of them. Yeah, I cut out four of them. So I just finally just glittered it and made it look like it needed to be that way. But then on the next one, it cut it out. So I don't know. So there's a flip. And another flip. And it's a magnet closure. Over here... I made a shaker pocket with acetate. This is a blue ribbon that Nilda Vanilla gifted me. And that's glitter in that pocket. It's just glitter. And then this one opens like this. And that is the second book, which is not completely finished but I tried I just don't know oh well <laughs> I thank you all for watching hugs to you from me and God bless